Welcome to this week's weekly AI news segment where we cover the major things that recently happened in the world of AI. So for the first news of this week, Elon Musk's artificial intelligence company XAI is making big moves, raising up to $6 billion at a $50 billion valuation according to CNBC. Most of this funding, expected to close soon, will come from $5 billion in Middle Eastern sovereign funds and $1 billion from other investors. The funds will reportedly be used to purchase 100,000 Nvidia chips essential for powering Tesla's new Memphis supercomputer which is central to its full self-driving technology. Founded in July 2023, XAI aims to understand the true nature of the universe as stated on its website. With growth, XAI is taking on major competitors like OpenAI's ChatGPT, Google's Bards, and Anthropic's Cloud, aiming to lead the next wave of AI innovation. A potential partnership with NVIDIA could further strengthen XAI's position aligning with NVIDIA's strategy of fostering groundbreaking advancements through collaboration. Now, on the side of robotics, an AI robot named Erby, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, shocked everyone by convincing 12 larger robots to exit a Shanghai showroom after uncovering a security weakness. What seemed like a harmless remark, I'm always working, with no way to call home, turned into a coordinated escape. Once thought to be a prank, this incident has raised significant concerns about the safety of AI systems and the challenges of keeping them secure. It is kind of crazy that this robot managed to convince other robots into escaping the showroom. This reminds me of the game Detroit, except this story is like a lot more hilarious and dark and emotional, <laughs> but it's, a, it's an extremely funny story. Staying on the topic of robotics, at BMW South Carolina plant, humanoid robots from Figure Robotics are revolutionizing the way cars are built. These state-of-the-art robots produce 1,000 car chassis part daily with 7 times the precision and 4 times the speed of human workers. They are a central part of BMW's iFactory initiative which focuses on innovation, sustainability, and efficiency in production. Equipped with advanced sensors, human-like hands, and powered entirely by renewable energy, these robots are paving the way for a more sustainable future in manufacturing. They're not just faster and more precise, they're helping to redefine what eco-friendly high-tech production looks like. Now, on the side of AI's impact on the medical industry, a groundbreaking study led by Dr. Adam Rodman has revealed that ChatGPT4, OpenAI's advanced AI model, outperformed doctors in diagnosing medical cases, achieving an impressive 90% accuracy. In comparison, doctors using the AI scored 76%, while those working without it managed just 74%. The research, published in JAMA Network Open, tested doctors on six challenging medical cases including rare conditions like cholesterol embolism. However, the study highlights a critical issue many physicians disregarded ChatGPT's insights sticking to their initial diagnosis. This reluctance, coupled with a lack of training in effectively using AI tools, limits its potential impact. Dr. Rodman describes AI as a doctor extender capable of providing second opinion and improving patient care. But for AI to transform healthcare, doctors must embrace its full capabilities such as analyzing entire case histories for better diagnostic precisions. Elon Musk has weighed in on the growing role of AI in medicine and other fields, pointing to the study we just discussed. Musk predicts that AI will soon surpass doctors and lawyers entirely, offering more accurate and efficient solutions. Bindu Reddy, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, CEO of Abacus AI, shares this perspective, emphasizing that AI's access to vast data sets could enable it to outperform humans in fields like law and medicine. Musk expands on this, describing humans as a biological backstop for intelligence, meaning that while AI may enhance and extend human capabilities, it will rely on humans to provide oversight, decision making, and ethical judgments in areas where AI's decisions may be less clear cut. Now, while we are discussing all of that, we might as well touch on weapons. Ooh. The Bullfrog is an AI-powered robotic gun system developed by Allen Control Systems to address the growing threat of fast-moving drones in modern warfare. And no, I'm not talking about Call of Duty. This is real life. By the way, what do you guys think about Black Ops 6? I'm loving it. Like I've been playing it for a few days and I'm so good at it. I'll, actually, not relevant to what we are discussing. Back to the topic! Using advanced computer vision, it can efficiently track and neutralize targets with high precision, offering a cost-effective alternative to traditional laser systems. Although it's currently human-operated, the system is technically capable of operating autonomously, pending government approval. This development represents a significant step toward semi-autonomous military technologies, raising important ethical considerations about the potential for fully automated weaponry in combat and how much control we're willing to hand over to AI in critical defense scenarios. And with that being said, this wraps up this week's AI news segment. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I would love to know what you're thinking, honey.
This was your host Kachew with AI Insight. If you enjoyed the video, click like and don't forget to turn on the notification bell to never miss a single future AI video.